everyone and welcome to Traffic Talk. This is Taylor and I am the co-owner of Financial Potion where we provide video marketing solutions to business owners. So today's Traffic Talks, we're going to be talking about YouTube cards. During the Traffic Talk episodes, I just talk to you guys about information that I feel you should know typically has to do with marketing and in, in uh, preparing for an upcoming workshop where it's all about YouTube optimization, I want to share about YouTube tips. So, the YouTube tip I want to share with you today is about using cards. Cards are mobile friendly hot links that can then link to other areas you want to bring people to. This might sound very familiar if you've already been using YouTube for your video marketing because you used to use annotations. Annotations used to be the ways to get people to other videos, get people to other channels, and get people to your website. However, annotations are not mobile friendly. And so, you're going to want to use cards that are mobile friendly. Half of the traffic that's on YouTube is mobile traffic. And so we're going to want to favor to what is mobile friendly. Thank you so much for the hearts on that. I truly appreciate it. So, what are you going to be able to do with these cards? With these cards, the number one thing I always suggest people to do is have it linked to your website. If you verify your website on YouTube, Thank you so much for the hearts and joining. If you verify your website on YouTube, you can then provide a hyperlink from your video into your website. And isn't that really the goal? Isn't that always what we want to do? We want to get people to our website. So now you can that much sooner by using a card and having that hyperlink to link straight to your website. You can also use cards in order to promote the nonprofits that you love and you love to work with. On each of these traffic tops, I, I save them when my phone decides to save them for me. I save them and then I put them on YouTube when I can. And when I put them on YouTube, I have my amazing gal Alexis put a card that links to a nonprofit. So that way I can help the nonprofits that I work with just that little bit more through getting donations. So thank you so much for joining. This is Traffic Talks and today's topic is about YouTube cards. So we've already discussed how you can add YouTube cards to link to your website. You can add YouTube cards to link to nonprofits in order to help them with some extra donations. You can also use YouTube cards in order to link to other videos. Perhaps you have a longer video that have many ideas that link to other videos, perhaps other how-to videos. You can then use cards, once again, these mobile-friendly links, in order to link to the other videos. Yes, so YouTube cards. They are a tool within your YouTube video manager in order to get people to where you want them to go that much faster. I highly suggest that you take a look at them. And to get to that, you want to go to your creator studio and then go to your video manager. And if you're really getting confused right now, I highly suggest just reach out to me individually. We provide one-to-one -one training and we also have a lot of workshops. Um, we're having a real estate professional workshop here on Friday the 25th and so please reach out to me if you want to learn more one-to-one. -one. So YouTube cards, a tool within your video manager that you can link to your website, link to nonprofits, link to other videos, and then also link to other channels. Perhaps you are a representative of a company. There's a lot of network marketing companies that may want to have their own YouTube channel and then they might want to link to their main company's channel for supporting information in other videos. You can once again use those YouTube card links in order to link to those other channels. It's really great if you have strategic partners. Help each other out. Link to those other areas. You can also use cards in order to start a poll. It's a great way to get your subscribers to start interacting. Ask a poll in the middle of the video and get people to interact. You know, we're always talking about having to start that two-way conversation. And now on cards, I mean, once again, that's mobile friendly, you can start that two-way conversation. Cards are so powerful. I highly suggest that if you're using YouTube, you need to make sure you're using cards correctly. And so if you're not, go onto your YouTube channel right now, go to your video manager and check out cards, or reach out to me one-to-one. -one. I'd love to help you. Like I said, we provide one-to-one -one training, and we also do workshops all the time. We do a monthly workshop up in, in the AZ Social Media Ways Training Center at the 51 in Greenway. Uh, that's open to everyone, where you can learn how to create and optimize a YouTube channel and learn how to do video marketing on your own. 
Uh, like I said, I'm having a real estate professional workshop here in about one week. So all these opportunities to learn and hey, information's at our fingertips. You can Google how to do anything, how to operate your cards correctly, and you'll find the answer. I highly suggest reach out to me as well. I'd love to help you. This is Tabler again with Financial Potion. We're providing video marketing solutions to business owners. And I want to help you use cards on your videos because it's a great way to get people to get to where you want them to go that much faster. So I hope you're all having a wonderful day. This is going to finish Traffic Talks for now. Make sure you go to my YouTube channel and subscribe because we do upload old Traffic Talk episodes onto there. So that way you can look at all the great information and learn all the great information that we discuss during this time of me being in traffic. So subscribe to the YouTube channel once again that's under Financial Potion because we do believe video is the potion to relieve business owners of their financial worries. So go out there and start recording.